Hey, welcome to Cosmic Tides. We're going to see how the cosmic currents are pulling for Cancer. This is going to be your bonus love reading. Down below, I will have the timestamp if you want to skip past my talking. Links for my Spotify, Apple Music, and Instagram will be down below, as well as my email for $20 personal readings. Due to a high volume of requests, I need at least 2-3 days to get them done after transaction, so I appreciate you for your patience. Keep in mind these energies are interchangeable. If this isn't you, this can be your partner or whoever. This can definitely be a vice versa reading, okay? Um, so I want to talk to you guys about what I have in my hand first. I had pulled some cards on the side, uh, to see how this person that you're dealing with is viewing you and the situation or feeling about you in this situation, I should say. And, um, and if you notice, there's a lot of blue in here. So there's a lot of, um, emotions on this person's side here, okay? This person's being very emotional right now. Could definitely be a water sign too or have water placements in their chart. But I'm definitely seeing somebody, um... Yeah, I'm definitely seeing somebody over here. If you could tell, this is like the same image, okay? One's just lacking the extra people here, okay? So I'm definitely seeing here who's somebody um, that you're dealing with is trying to um, really look within for this answer right now. I definitely see one half of them wants to be with you here, and then the other half I see is being crippled by like traumatizing experiences in their past, either with you or other relationships here, and it's preventing them from reaching out here to you see them trying to gain a higher perspective here. I see them trying to make a decision here, okay? So I definitely see this person trying to make a decision if they're going to come towards you here um, or if they're going to clear this out, okay? So that's what I see. Somebody who's really trying to make a decision here. I see them kind of going back and forth with themselves here over um, reaching out to you, okay? Um, basically. Um, so what I have here is, um, yeah, you're being asked to confidently accept the opportunities that you're offered right now. So you or this person, like I said, this could be vice versa. I definitely see somebody being held back here. Um, yeah, they're being held back here from, um, making or taking an offer here, okay? Somebody's being held back from growing anything because they feel like there's competition when it comes to a, um, a happy home life with somebody here okay so I definitely see this person watching you from afar and keeping their distance but wanting to come towards you which is really interesting especially because um this is the wheel so a time of positive change a situation suddenly moves forward I do see this another way I do see um I do see if you just offered I do see if you just made this offer here um I think that would push a lot of whatever crap you're dealing with forward but like I said I see somebody who has fears who has fears so I definitely see somebody um being crippled here and not not coming forward letting their fears cripple them and keeping a distance that's what I'm really seeing here which is really interesting um and then I have here yeah somebody's spending a lot of quiet time alone here um somebody's spending a lot of quiet time alone here somebody is healing and somebody is also um, thinking about nurturing a situation here, um, thinking about making um, some positive, optimistic, long-term plans here. That's what I'm seeing. Yeah, somebody is definitely contemplating here about making, um, yeah, about making an offer here. Okay, so somebody's contemplating about making an offer here. Um, but I see them um, being held back here. Release the fears that hold you back, okay? That's what I'm really seeing. Um, yeah, I see you allowing more time before you make a decision here. Um, yeah, I see you allowing more time before you make a decision here, before you make a decision to put an effort here to gain a celebration. Uh, I see you allowing more time here before you communicate, okay? Yeah, before you communicate with this person. I see you looking for guidance online, uh, watching tarot's on the YouTube, on the YouTube, and I'm seeing, yeah, I'm seeing you're at a temporary standstill right now. Okay, I see you're at a temporary standstill right now. I see you definitely taking some time here. So you're definitely thinking this through carefully. Um, yeah, you're waiting for perfect timing here. You're waiting for perfect timing to reach out. I see you, um, yeah, you're still holding yourself back here. Still holding yourself back here. Um, kind of being a little stubborn here. Um, but I definitely see you holding yourself back, and um, 
I see that you're seeing the truth of the situation. Um, I'm seeing that this is a challenging beginning for you, but I definitely do see brilliant new ideas and inspirations come your way. Um, I do see you moving forward, um, but I definitely see that your past keeps you kind of stuck here. Your past keeps you kind of stuck from moving forward towards this person here, uh, which is really interesting. Really interesting. Um... Yeah, I'm seeing that, yeah, I'm definitely seeing that you're spending a lot of quiet time alone here. You're taking some time for yourself, allowing more time before you make a decision here. Um, yeah, definitely in a temporary standstill. So you might be in a stalemate with somebody right now. Um, but I definitely see you, um, I definitely see you thinking about nurturing a situation here. You're thinking about making some positive, optimistic, long-term plans. You're thinking about putting in some effort here. Thinking about putting in some effort here. Um, waiting for the perfect timing. Waiting for perfect timing to reach out here. Waiting for perfect timing to reach out here to make an offer. So you can have a celebration. But seeing you being held back here. Yeah, seeing you being held back here, being asked to release the fears that are holding you back so you can communicate. Um, yeah, so you communicate, so you can communicate, yeah. So I definitely see just a whole bunch of kind of going back and forth with yourself, um, wanting to communicate, but holding yourself back, waiting for the perfect timing. Um, but it's because you have a lot of fears that are holding you back here and you're being asked you're being asked to um, communicate with this person, release the fears that are holding you back, communicate with this person um, so you can move forward because this was a challenging beginning for you. But um, I definitely think you're going to be um, realizing this. Um, if you're cross-watching for a cancer, um, you're probably going to be the one who has to reach out here. Um, yeah, you're probably going to have to be the one who reaches out here. Especially if this person always hits you up, if this person is always reaching out for you and then they stopped. Um, this is like your cue to um, step up, step in here. Um, only if you want this. You don't have to listen to me at, at all, okay? And also... Um, you know, this is not going to resonate for everybody here. Um, this is a general reading, so only take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Um, I would, please do not force feed yourself this reading here. If your relationship is toxic, just leave the person alone, move on, because I'm not, I'm not going to sit here and tell you to um, get back with a toxic, abusive person. I would never tell you to do that. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, if this is something toxic, this is not for you, okay? But um, I'm definitely seeing here you're going back and forth with yourself over making a decision here. And it's telling you to confidently accept the opportunities that you're offered. And um, I'm feeling like that is also remnant to, um, you know, making the, the offer as well. Have confidence when you make the offer as well. Um, because look, worst case scenario, because we do all have free will, worst case scenario, if this person says no or turns you down, okay, well, now you kind of can close the case on that one and you can move on to someone or something better. Be proud of yourself that you actually um, had the courage to speak up or ask this person out or this, that, and the third, you know what I mean? Um, you should be proud of yourself even if this person does say no. Because um, you had the courage, you had the courage and the confidence to um, speak your truth to this person. You know what I mean? Um, <clears throat> so I really like that. Uh, I definitely see a lot of fear, though. A lot of fear is keeping you from coming forward to this person. And um, it's kind of for nothing. It's kind of for nothing. Um, you're kind of worrying too much about this. Yeah, you're kind of worrying too much about this. Um... Because like I said, there's so much blue in here. There's so much blue in here. I'm thinking like this is you. This isn't really the person that you're um, that you're dealing with. I'm thinking this person has a lot of cross watchers though. <laughs> um, 
and because I'm definitely sensing more of a cross watcher energy here. Um, but yeah, it's really interesting. Really, really interesting. Um, I'm gonna leave it there. Let me just tell you um, what signs you could be dealing with. So definitely you could be dealing with the Pisces, okay, or somebody with strong Pisces in their chart. Could be dealing with the Gemini as well. Um, could be dealing with another Cancer or have somebody with Cancer in their chart. Could be dealing with an Aquarius, someone who somebody who has Aquarius in their chart. Um, could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Excuse me. Or someone who has Sagittarius in their chart could be dealing with a Virgo or somebody who has Virgo in their chart um, or a Capricorn or somebody who has Capricorn in their chart or a Libra or somebody who has Libra in their chart or an Aries, somebody who has Aries in their chart. OK, so I'm going to leave that there. I hope that was good for you guys. I'll catch you next week. OK, bye.